Welcome to Good Mythical More. How well do you know iconic fast food burgers and how they are arranged? And how well do we? But first, let's donate $1,000 to Human Rights Initiative of North Texas. Human Rights Initiative provides legal and support services to refugees and immigrants who have suffered human rights abuses and promotes international human rights. Please join us in giving at hrionline.org. Thank you for being your mythical best and for hanging out with us. Whew, after those cheeseburgers, man, I, you know, some some days I can I can just push through, but I, something about the fish today, it was just very. It was visceral. It was I'm, visceral I'm sorry. for you, and it's visceral for me to have to be next to you while it was happening. I'm but sorry. I'm not saying it would have willed either way, but uh, it didn't help. Hi. I know I it didn't. Hey, look at Stevie. We got like some sort of. Yeah, this is fun. It this reminds is... me of like the little, you know, play school cook kitchens that you have when you when you're growing up. Reminds me of like the stuff. felt board that we had at church. Oh, I yeah, but know, it's not back yeah. in like, it's but not... it's not felt. It's it's magnets. Did you it's... guys have like images magnets, of Jesus yeah. and stuff? Oh, uh, we had we had all types of characters. Ev yeah. Everything. You would have mm -hmm. like um, uh, you'd have an ark. There'll you be lots of Moses. Shoving animals You're familiar on there. Oh, Moses. Yeah, yeah, Moses was, was on my yeah. felt board. Yeah, yeah. yeah, you had an art probably. No, no, I didn't have a felt board. I, felt boards are, are just for Christians. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, this, this reminds me more of uh, my fridge growing up. I had a yep. bunch of magnets on the fridge because uh -huh. I used it to display my art and my mom would display I know, my what art. kid says that they use the fridge to display their art? Like that's such an interesting look at it because it, it's it's the it's the parents. I use it to display it. my art for my mom, yeah. <laughs> who would not do it, who would not put it up otherwise. <laughs> well, how? Yeah, how else would she? Do you know a it? lot of these? Please, new, mom, look at these my new art. fridges uh, are not magnetic. Have you noticed that? Like you'll get like a, a new no. fridge and, and all of a sudden it's just like magnets won't stick to it. David's saying yeah enthusiastically as if this yeah, is all Yeah, it's he like cares why, why they shouldn't have done that. That shouldn't have been a thing. That shouldn't have happened. Yeah, well we need to st we need to start like a petition. Make fridges magnetic again. Yeah, right. It'll oh, be a, God. it'll be all a right, red so, hat. Um, so you're going to test okay. our knowledge. Yeah, yeah. So it's going to be super simple. I'm going to give you the name of an iconic burger from a well-known fast food restaurant. I know there's and you guys are burger. each going to use your individual kind of felt boards to construct the burger to the best of your ability. And then afterwards, I'm going to walk you through what's actually on that burger. Okay. All right. I'm, do you think you're going to be good at this? No. Um, you're you're a person who takes things off of a burger, so you regularly open a burger to see what's on it. I just take a burger out of a package and bite into it. Yeah, the order of items is, is never so goes through my mind. True. So yeah, um, I don't think I will get one of these right, but I'm going to try as hard as I possibly. Well, can. I'm definitely putting the tomato over here because that's what I'm used to. I okay. mean, but you have. But, but I also have, order burgers the was, way that though. I want it. I, yeah, I will. So I don't really take stuff off usually unless they get it wrong. But you're right. I have an advantage. The Wendy's Baconator. Okay. okay, bacon. And we have more than one bacon to work with. Uh, First of all, let me just much? say, really, really good burger. Mm hmm. Uh, and I don't, I don't now want to. Now think in terms of the order. It doesn't. That's not going to dock you points. But that's how my answer reveal goes. So it's really helpful for me if you what? think of the proper order of the no, burger. It, no, that's part of it. That, is that it? has to be part of yeah, it. Yeah, I agree with Link. You said the, the order well, is Well, then is think part. about the order very closely because I will dock points so away a, if it's the wrong order. We have a sesame seed bun and a non-seeded bun. Uh, baconator, baconator. Now, I, I just, I'm, I'm not looking at your board right now even though I'm looking at you. And so, gentlemen's agreement, let's not look at each other's board so we don't have to hide it from the audience as we're doing this, okay? Yeah, 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 I'm not looking at the board. Uh, um, oh, these are, one says charboiled patty and one just says beef patty. So I'm not so sure that's important. Oh, it's important. Hmm, I, I, I don't, I've only had this on the show. Okay, well I'll take. I've never ordered. Does it have pickles? I don't think so. Oh gosh, I'm definitely have. It's, it's just there's so many things on this burger that I'm having trouble just getting yeah, the placement right. 
Mmm, Baconator, Baconator, Baconator. Oh. Okay. So, I, I would say if you get this stuff right, you get a point for everything, but then you get another, I don't know, there's got to be a secondary oh, scoring is. for a... Uh, got poor Selene back here, like, scrambling to change the <laughs> the scoreboard with all of your, your detailed, intricate point systems. By the time this episode, whoever's watching it, you will have the correct score on the board. I promise you. Oh, All right. Now I've made a promise that I have no responsibility for. Where's the other? Oh, there's the other bank. Okay, I've got. I, I, I'm locked in. Okay. Okay. Now I've really screwed over the graphics team, and I'm sorry, Zach. <laughs> but we just need numbers. Is all I mean. Okay. So, go, tell me what you got here. I went. Uh, Patty, no, but what is that? Bun, <laughs> patty, cheese, bacon, and then patty, okay, so cheese, did I. bacon again. Okay, I did the same thing. Bun, patty, cheese, bacon. Patty, cheese, patty, bacon. Che pat no, patty, bacon, cheese. Oh, shoot. You, that was probably unintentional, but you can't switch it now. No, it was unintentional. Uh, then special sauce. Oh, yeah. And then a bun. I don't think there's any onions on so a we, Baconator. We basically agreed, except for I think it's, onions. It, I, the thing I loved about it, if I remember it correctly, is the simplicity of just a lot of bacon, a lot of cheese, and some special sauce. Okay, I'm going top down. Regular non-seated bun. Got it. Check. Mayo. What? Well, I mean, it's, it's, mayo can be special. No, it's not. Mayo is yeah. this. We have a thing that's called mayo. Ketchup. What? Yeah, mayo and ketchup mixed together makes a special sauce That's like what Thousand we were Island. Thinking, but it mixes together in my of, mouth. I kind of agree with that. Yeah, so but we're, it's not. We're, no, no, no. We're both right. We're okay. both right. We're both wrong. No, we're both right. Agree. It's a special okay, sauce, or it's not. If it's okay. mayo and but it's not onions, so we got uh, we, this is a, a a demerit for him. Yeah, bacon. Yep, no. I was right. I was wrong by accident, but yeah. Cheese. Correct. Beef patty. Correct. Mm -hmm. Bacon. Correct. Cheese. Correct. Beef patty. Correct. Bun. I'm completely 100% right. I dispute your ketchup and mayonnaise no. makes a special Thousand Island sauce. Well, it read it does, but if that happens on the burger, by making by putting those two things, then it's the two things. You I still dispute win. dispute this. It doesn't matter. Well, you, I just thought I wouldn't win. get any of them right. All right, so that was good. Let, let's reset. Can someone come in and reset this? <laughs> just kidding. Okay. Next. Oh gosh, this is exhausting though. This is a good game for, for adult men. You want me to reset that? You already doing it. No, no it's Chase, Chase is like, Chase. You're, you're, Chase, don't, don't do that for him. Don't, don't, <laughs> really. Okay, what's next, Stevie? Uh, the Whopper from Burger King. Ooh. The Whopper. Ooh, 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 whopper. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. The so Whopper, 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 Whopper. Uh huh, uh huh, huh. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. 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 I'm not looking at yours, I'm and I'm not also looking not. At yours. I'm not talking because because that would be cheating. Yeah. Uh huh. I don't know where the. Where's my stuff? I don't Here know is. where they do this on a. Hmm. Where did they? All right. Hey, remember when you guys talked about your felt boards at church? Yeah, man. It's, it's pretty funny because I often felt bored at church. Ha! All right, bye. Hey! Yeah! Hey, Carney. You didn't have to do that, but you did. <laughs> and I thank you. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you think this is how they teach the employees at the places how to make... The burgers? Uh huh. I hope. Oh, good gosh. There's a Where lot. does Moses go? There's a lot that goes on there. Moses couldn't eat this, Stevie. The <laughs> you don't know. If Actually, it's he could. This kosher. order is. He could. I don't. I don't know how kosher. I feel about this. About this order. Okay. I said sesame seed bun, mayo. We agree. Oh crap! I left ketchup off. You I added ketchup. Pickles. I you. I put pickles. Then we both said onions. The tomato and the lettuce was, uh, you, you're probably right about I this. Inverted I inverted mine. Because I don't know. Lettuce going over the tomato, and then you didn't add cheese. I was hoping you would fall for that and add no, cheese. No, a Whopper with cheese has got cheese on it, but yeah, not a Whopper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, okay, so where, how are we doing, Stevie? Charboard patty. I'm going from top down. Sesame seed top bun. Check. Ding. Mayo. Yes. Check. 
lettuce. Oh. oh, big one. Yeah. Tomatoes. Oh, next. Onions. Really? Oh, I had these exactly <laughs> inverted. All three of them wrong. Ketchup. And then the ketchup is on the top of the Isn't patty? That weird. I no, think that, ketchup pickles. I mean, I guess the ketchup and the pickles. I think the are ketchup like, and know, the mayo entwined. on each side of these mm. of the vegetables holds it all together. Yeah. Uh, okay. Ketchup pickles, one beef patty. Charbroil. Oh, is it not charbroil? It is. It yeah. is charbroil. It's Burger King. It's got to be. Why don't I have that in my. Uh... has to be. Yeah. We I did agree. not accept any Just I, access I will your... accept it and I, I will agree with you and the bottom button. Okay, so I don't know how to score this. I mean, Link, you oh. got the uh, lettuce and tomato in the right order, just in the wrong place. But mm -hmm. I got them in the wrong order and the wrong place. You added pickles, but they're in the wrong place. I don't. I honestly don't know how to score this. We need we need rules to the game. Well, thank we, you. <laughs> I think we tied. Uh, you know, I think you tied. Yeah, I think first round first round went to Rhett. This round is a tie. That's how we're scoring it is I will just say at the end of the round okay. what the general score is. Okay, so Stevie comes along in the box with every one of these games that we sell to tell you how the score, how we get scored. Okay. I mean, r really, this is probably how they train people. They test burger makers, because you don't want to waste, waste a bunch of stuff. Burgers. What's next? Okay. This is, I think, the most complicated because I think this chain has the most customization options in my personal experience. Okay. But you need to construct a double double animal style from In and Out. Okay. Double double animal style. So we... Cassie's In and Out order was just obnoxious for a time period. But they like love it. I feel like they just like soak that up. They want a really complicated order. Hmm. Double double animal style. Uh, is there... uh, oh gosh, I this is what I get, and I can't tell you what's on it. Again, I just eat it. Um, maybe. Okay, I, I no. Oh, animal style. They do Crap. that. This is tough. They do. Yeah, that. I know what I know what this is. There's something. There's something missing. That there, there's not. Do you have a mustard? No. Mustard is a part of animal style. We don't, but but we'll just we'll just say onions count as grilled onions. Onions are grilled onions. We'll say that. Just say it. And then onions are grilled onions. Uh, shoot, this is tough, man. Um, hmm. Uh, shoot. Crap. What do I do? Shoot crap. Okay. All right. I'm gonna get rid of these, clean it up. All right. I, I think I'm locked in, actually. I'm close. Hold on. Um, and then. Yeah, I need to. That's right. I mean, it's a testimony of these burgers that, like, once you order it and you eat it, it's just a thing. It's, it's, it's greater than the sum of its parts. Okay. I'm locked in. You put a lot. Look. You put a lot more on mine. First of all, I think you, you have to breath? order cheese. <sighs> oh, I, what, I, a double double. I, I usually don't say cheeseburger. I guess I just say double double. With animal, animal style has cheese and stuff on it, right? Doesn't it? Does it? Yeah, I. I, I you said you didn't say cheeseburger. Though. Yeah, you said hamburger. If you say double double animal style, which is what you I say, double, double, al always has cheese on it. Yeah. Hold on. The double is the double cheese. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I screwed up. Um. Okay. So from the top. Regular non-seeded bun. Yep. Animal style, which is grilled onion, mustard, and relish. So special sauce and onions. Oh, that See? should have been pickles. Okay. Well, don't move it I around because we can't tell score you. you. My yeah. beliefs in a moment. I mean, so I we, said special sauce and onions, and so did Link, and we were indicating that that was the animal okay. style mixture. Yes. But okay, it needed. But I didn't know memory, it needed pickles. Well, relish. In your memory. Yeah. Does the animal style? stuff not have the special sauce mixed into all of it into one conglomeration definitely it does for me but uh, for uh, but, me too not for david well no special sauce and then the grilled onions is like an extra scoop because if you get the fries well David's sometimes they won't have sauce on them the grilled onion mustard and relish blend cheese two beef patties lettuce tomatoes special sauce pickles and a bottom bun and in my memory the special sauce is mixed in to the situation spread well 
I've got pretty daggone close because I put the lettuce in there. I didn't put. I didn't think it had tomato on it. Again, I eat it tomato and not realize I'm eating it. Well, this is controversial, isn't it? I mean, we why have are... multiple votes for separate sauce back here, so maybe it's just I get animal style fries. But so maybe isn't there a me. isn't there a definitive source for this information? No. Like all of a sudden it's we're going on, off it's on of the, our it's on the secret menu. They we're going off of not our memory. That I mean, we're going off of their menu, correct? Yeah. But I don't feel like a menu would say like then we mix all this into a special sauce and then we like I'm just saying well, first I think of all, there's room for some disputes here. The le- well, that's okay. clear. The lettuce is on the bottom, so I missed that. But I got the cheese uh on top of each mm. patty and then the special sauce and the onions. I only missed the placement of the lettuce as far as I could tell. Yeah, I think this round goes to Rhett. Yeah, well, that's And let clear. me tell you who the round doesn't go to. Me. David and Slain. <laughs> uh, and pickles on the bottom. Pickles on the bottom. It's a good burger. They put the cold toppings below and the hot drippy toppings above. I think it's brilliant. Uh, if you want to see people hash that out, you can look at the Mythical Kitchen channel where they did toppings versus bottomings and came to definitive conclusions. Uh-huh. Okay. Um, What's next? You know, i got to redeem Rhett, myself. I meant to tell you that your shirt looks really great today. And I'm not talking about the shirt that you're wearing I don't, like, I, that we can see right now. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, I, yeah. Rhett, I was just wondering, could you... Let me take your shirt off, just unbutton it a little bit. I mean, I'm, I know I wouldn't you, normally you know, ask you. You know how modest I am, so. I'm, I mean, just, I'm just curious what I might find. It's just, a little uncomfortable. There's but. something I could find under there? Oh, maybe. Yeah, maybe. I get this out of the way. Maybe. 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 Let's see if there's any. If you, maybe you can find. Huh! Right. Look what I found. It's a brand new shirt available at mythical.com. <laughs> How's that for an ad? <laughs> you talk about finding something. Find this on your body. It's an inside joke, yeah, if you've and, ever seen the show before. And it's a uh, true to size, life size can. Oh, you can grab that. Because you know that's how a can looks in my hand. Well, you know what's actually true to life size? Well, kind of, is we also have a koozie, a matching koozie oh, yeah, with you can, this design. Yeah, that you, can you can get put with what this t-shirt. is based on in a koozie. I love a good koozie. Every night I drink my Topo Chico in a koozie. Yep. Mm-hmm. It makes me feel like I'm on vacation. Yeah, that was a great ad. I like the part where you paused for a long amount of time and didn't say anything. That's yeah, 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 yeah. That's, part. We gave people time to look at the shirt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So people yeah, can only process call. so many things at once, Stevie. Yeah, yeah. Um, I don't want your backhanded criticisms. Oh, Western bacon cheeseburger Ooh. from Carl's Jr. Carl's Jr. Western bacon. Oh, yes, here's the koozie, too. Oh, Western bacon cheeseburger. Western bacon cheeseburger. Carl's Jr. Carl's Jr. Do they do it? I mean, it's all about do they do it in a traditional style or do they do it in a weird way? Uh, mm-hmm. Where would you put that? Feels like you wouldn't. Mm-hmm. This feels like a bet. It feels like something they wouldn't, mm-hmm. shouldn't do, but maybe they did do it. Shoot. And then I do think that they do this. Do they do that? Or stern looking cheeseburger. Hmm. Uh I don't know. Hmm. This is this is I think I, I'm having tr- trouble here. I'm I think I'm doing okay this time. I'm I'm really trying. All right. I feel like, oh gosh, does it have pickles or not? If I, mm, I'm gonna say no, there's no pickles. Western, did, what did you call it? A bacon, Western bacon? Western bacon cheeseburger. Well, crap, I definitely think it has bacon. Well, you almost didn't put the bacon on the Western bacon Western cheeseburger. Western bacon cheeseburger. I'm locked in. I'm locked in. So we okay. agreed, it started off with a bun. Bar- barbecue sauce. I added mayo, then onion rings. For some reason, I added regular onions. I, that was stupid. Mm, but they're up there now. They're up there now. Bacon, bacon, cheese, cheese burger. And then you did a double. I did, I did a did double. A single because she didn't say double, but maybe it is double. It is Carl's Jr. After all. And I think it's they're charbroiled at at um at Carl's Jr., which oh, you did not do. I didn't even so, think about that. 
sesame seed bun. Oh, dang crap. it. I got down right, to that. We're still, e- we're still even on that. Barbecue sauce. Yes, we're even on that. Well, no, because you said mayo. What? Maybe she's about to say mayo. Bacon. She did. Oh. Bacon's next. Okay, well, we both got bacon. Cheese. Cheese. Yes. One charboiled beef patty. Oh. Okay. What? And then the other? Then the onion rings on the bottom? Onion rings. And then oh, the... Oh, crap. Then the, more barbecue sauce. More barbecue sauce. Button. Mm. Okay, well, Link, you added an extra patty. Shh. Okay. I, you but know. you got the charbroil, so that's a wash. You, you're killing. But, you're you add, killing. but you added onions and you added mayo, and neither one of those things exists on it. So I think I got to take this round as well. Definitely. Yep. Man, yep. I, this is my favorite new game. This is, I mean, yeah, because it, it resonates with your inner hungry preschooler. Yeah, man. I've gotten that. I, I've gotten that burger a couple of times. Well, I wouldn't have told you that the onion rings are on the bottom. I would have told you lots of stupid. I things. bet you you can get them. I bet you it's, they're not. They don't always do it the same way at every place. I mean, that's probably how it is. That's because well. they haven't gone through this exercise. Yeah. Okay, guys, this is worth four points. <laughs> yeah, you about to erase my incredible performance? <laughs> I think we all know the real winner here today. Okay. McDonald's quarter pounder with cheese. McDonald's quarter pounder. Okay. Mm-hmm. McDonald's quarter pounder with cheese. I have not had this in so long. Oh man, it's a good burger though. Uh, shoot, quarter pounder. I like messing with the score like this because you know with cheese. Half of the mythical beasts think that I pull for Rhett, and half the mythical beasts think that I pull for Link, and I get to piss off whoever. Right. I right. The other half. It. And yeah, and it's great. And it goes back and forth and it's But in fairness, for me. I mean, I'm the one who should be getting in on this one because of that whole thing that I just said about, you know, uh the backhanded thing. Remember that? You should be I should be getting what? flack for that. It's like what's his problem? Yeah, yeah. Tell tell the people what you should be getting flack for. Quarter pounder with I cheese. don't know what the condiments on a quarter pounder are. It's been so long. I definitely know that that's on it. And I don't, I'm pretty sure that is not on it. And I know that that's on it. And I'm pretty sure that is on it. And I think that it's... I think it's, I think, I think I know, I think I know something here. I think this is, ha- this happens. You don't agree? I'm sticking to my guns, Twinkie Fingers. All right, I'm locked in. Okay, I'm locked in. Oh crap, I didn't put ketchup anywhere. Sesame seed bun. Yep, sesame seed bun. Ketchup. Ah, no ketchup. Mustard. We don't have mustard. Yeah. Okay. Onion. Yes! Cheese. Ah. One beef patty. Yep. Cheese. Cheese again, I got that. You did too. Bottom bun. I was, the only thing I didn't get was. So there's no pickles or tomato on a. Everything was right, except we didn't have mustard as an option and I put pickles on and it wasn't. There. There's no pickles on a quarter pounder with cheese? I also and no tomato. Hard to believe that is wild. No tomato. That's crazy. Not unfortunately. (laughs) (laughs) You're right. Yes. Go with it. No, no, no. Say that. Say (laughs) unfortunately. Really? (laughs) Just very. No, no. Because I think that cancels out both sides. You say, say. Unfortunately, I've got to give this one to Rhett. Which I mean, the Rhett folks are feeling good, and the Link folks feel like you feel sorry for them. Everybody's happy. That's what I meant. Oh. There are pickles. There are pickles, but where are they? Yes! So I was 100% right. Unfortunately, Rhett was 100% right. <laughs> give me extra points. What do I win? I will give you extra points. You can take home your board and everything on it. I got 100,000 points, but can you say, just, just for everybody's sake, unfortunately, Rhett gets 100,000 points. Unfortunately, Rhett gets 100,000 points. Take that to the bank. They aren't a sponsor, but they are the inspiration for the soda can tea and koozie available now at mythical.com.